Hey, yo, 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 everybody, Generic V here, and welcome back to the Minecraft Vanilla server. Uh, you may notice, just gotta start it, may notice that a couple things, one, my throat is <clears throat> a little bit, still recovering, still trying to get over this, a uh, little bit of sickness. I, I feel good, it's just throat-wise, it's a little bleh. And I apologize, I, see ya, pal. I apologize for the frame rate it looks very laggy today, um, and that is because Zisto has finished the map room. Um, if I look at that right now, I'm getting 15 frames per second, which is uh, half of my normal recording speed and a quarter of my normal play speed. Um, so it's that, I believe, is getting fixed. Item frames, that's the big thing. Item frames give a huge, uh, uh, you know it, man. Um, it gives a, a huge frame rate drop, and I believe Dinnerbone has fixed that in a snapshot. We're close. We're close to getting a snapshot, and that'll get fixed. Uh, but until then, we make do. You bet you will. <laughs> Confirmed. Pyro is going to play Ghost with us. Uh, but you saw in the last episode that old dirty B-dubs, he finagled me. He B-teamed me out of... Uh, out of what three three diamonds and a and a sword but what i forgot is that didn't we agree as part of this b team stuff that we would split the revenue anyway and then and then like the person who sells the most gets some kind of extra commission i think i can't remember i have to go back and look so it may not be so bad anyway maybe i beat b teamed him he b teamed me um, I went caving, and I got a bunch more gold, a bunch more gold, and I got more diamonds, so I'm back up to 21 diamonds, so I'm feeling good, feeling good about life. Uh, but, I said I needed this thing for, uh, just for the month of October, and that is because I've got an idea. Now, you know how, I'm just gonna grab a little bit of stuff here while I'm talking... Uh, anything else I need at the moment? That's probably pretty good for right now. Um, I am I'm not going to uh, build this thing while I'm talking because it's it's one of those like I spent a lot of time, a heck of a lot of time, uh, working on this in creative mode, and uh, it's a little bit of a complex thing, and I don't want to sit there. I don't want to try and talk with you guys and be like, okay, now how many was this? Was it three? Was it four? I can't remember. <laughs> um, but I'll do a little bit. So, you know, I don't know how it is in the, you know, in the other parts of the world, but here in, here in America, we have uh, this thing. Hey, who that? Oh, crap. Crap, 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 crap. Retreat, retreat, retreat. You are still coming at me, aren't you? And. Oh, and. Uh, and. Uh, yeah, ooh, three in a row. Get taken down. <laughs> oh, there's a creeper over there, too. Might as well get him while we're at it. Oh. And. Terrible. I blame the lag. That's what I blame. Now, already I'm wondering if I've done this right. Nope, I have not. See? This is why I need to do this off camera. Um, so I don't know about the rest of the world, but here in America, uh, we've got uh, every Halloween, there will be these places that pop up, and they usually, like, uh, take over, you know, like, uh, old grocery stores or uh, department stores that have closed down or, like... I know a lot of them around, you know, around where I live when, when Blockbuster Video, uh, you know, went under, they, um, you know, they kind of sprung up in, in the places of all the, uh, all the old Blockbusters. Um, it's the Halloween stores and it's, it's where they just kind of set up shop. They throw up a, you know, a really obnoxious looking, uh, sign on the front of the building and they, uh, that's not right. 
and it's where you can buy all your costumes and, and stuff to decorate your houses and, and all that good stuff. And I thought that since they usually only last, they come up in, you know, early uh, September in October time frame, and they usually last until October, and then everything goes on like wicked sale, and then and then they're gone. As quickly as they came, they, have, they disappear. And so I thought it would be kind of fun to do that in the uh, in spawn here. And so what I've got is a goofball, little goofball idea uh, for a for a Halloween shop. And of course, this is as obnoxious as obnoxious can be. I'm gonna put one right there, one right there, one right there. Oh, and oh, and oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's looking good. And I think I want to dig out. Let's see if this is where the path goes. I think it would be kind of neat if I eventually made a path going right to the thing, but I won't do that right now. Uh, I'll just make it go out one more like that. And dunk, dunk. See? And so it looks like a, a tongue with a mouth going in. So this will actually be the uh, the entrance going in. Boop, boop, boop. I've got a ton of work to do. Now this would normally be something I might do with a time lapse uh, with a camera account, uh, but I don't have one. And uh, I'm gonna be doing a whole bunch of switching back and forth, uh, cause it's kind of a complex build. So I'll be switching back and forth, uh, looking at it in my creative world, just to make sure I'm doing it all right. Um, plus I've got redstone to do and then some other really cool stuff to do with this. So I'm gonna work on this. I'm gonna come back, oh, when I come back, this thing should be all done, at least the shell of it. So I will be right back. Alrighty! Oh, all right! <laughs> hey, we... Okay, we back. I've been working on the... Uh, oh, my nose itches so bad. Oh, this dang uh, sickness. Uh, oh, by the way, while I was working, Zisto came on and he removed... Uh, the frames over there, and oh man, it's so much better. But um, he will he will put them back once we get the snapshot updated. Uh, okay, so are you ready for this? Where do I want to go? Maybe over here. And wow! <laughs> yep, creepy, huh? Got the. Uh... Got the old, like, kind of zombie head with some arms coming up there. And he's got his little freaky, freaky hands. And then over here, got his other freaky hand. And then not much on the back. It's just, uh, it's just kind of like he's hunched over. Ooh, what am I hitting? Like he's kind of hunched over. And then on the inside, we've got ourselves. You go through the mouth. Blah, 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 blah. And of course, got that little, uh, what's that, a uvula? Something like that. And um, here is where there's going to be a uh, all the costumes. And I've done it like this. So let's go through all the costumes, shall we? Um, here's the Spider-Man costume. Oh, and I have to thank the, uh, the people on my live stream uh, who hooked me up with some ideas on this because I think... You guys did a really good job. So, Spider-Man costume. Of course, we've got the uh, all the leather, some red with blue pants, and you hold the spider web. Uh, here, we've got a chicken costume. Uh, so, red top, got the white gold boots, and some eggs to hold and throw. Uh, so, this is a combo. You could either go as Flash or Iron Man. Uh, and so, it's got, because the colors were about the same, Got the uh, the gold helmet, red outfit with yellow uh, boots. And if you go as Flash, you get a speed of swiftness. If you go as Iron Man, you hold an iron ingot. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna save these for last. Oh, and notice, see, I've I've named the. Uh, all you gotta do is put a chest in the anvil, and you can name it, and it will uh, it will be whenever you open it. That's what the little title. I think this is super cool little add uh, addition to the game. Um, and then of course this one in the middle is a trap chest. You can see by that little bit of red around it. And that is how we can get three singles, oops, three singles in a row. Uh, over here we've got a zombie. 
Uh, so all this junk with an iron shovel and a slowness potion. Uh, we have a ghost costume, potion of invisibility, and you wear a white cap and tunic. So it looks really cool. Scarecrow, typical thing. Got your pumpkin that you wear on the head. Uh, you know, with a little outfit and you hold some wheat. Pretty princess. Got a gold crown. Oh, what's that? Okay, Pikmin. Uh, with the pink outfit, little glowy shoes, and a uh, and a blaze rod, which is like your little princess fairy wand. Uh, this is the knight costume, so it's all chain and with an iron sword, all glowy. And the death games costume. Now I do need to. I want to um, rename this sword, but it takes like eleven levels, so it's something like you know toy sword of justice or something but otherwise you can dress up like your favorite death games person and then these will be like premium ones um because they require some more uh pricey materials uh so this one is the headless horseman costume so it's all black no helmet you hold the jack-o-lantern and you have a potion of invisibility and this comes with a black horse which i have to get from uh blame's horse area um, Grim Reaper, ho ho, comes with a wither skeleton skull, uh, and, oh, actually, no, no, nope, that's a helmet, you can't do both, yeah, um, all of this with the, uh, with the iron hoe, uh, and then this will come with a white horse, because death comes on a pale horse, uh, and then a wither costume, so it's another wither skull, got the leather tunic, and a potion of invisibility, so you kind of can fly around, uh, yeah, so that's what I got. This is where you pay, and you notice that it is a uh, it is a trap chest, and that's because I want to do one other thing on here. I want to do something. Uh, let's, let's grab, oh, it's the new Minecracker, which, by the way, is not PewDiePie. Holy cow, you guys will believe anything. Of course, it's Sky Does Minecraft. Yo! Sky. And guys, it is not. I know I, I see a lot of folks going, I am so tired of this. I wish they would just sh show who it is type thing. Listen, they ain't my doing. And they. Hey, hi, Michael Jordan. They will. Uh, let's do a thing like that. And like that. This is going to be good. And then for right now, I'm just going to go like that. Hey, pause. Hey, pause. <laughs> um, so what my idea is, I want to have, I want to bring Wartilda right in here, right? And it's going to be with every payment, there's a trick or treat, right? So you open up the chest to make a payment because this is a trap chest. Uh, it'll get, there'll be a random option. It will either give you a treat, which will be some kind of like, I don't know, gold nugget or something like that, or, uh, it'll be a trick and this little glass will come up and the witch will be there and it will shoot something at you. So that's what I want to do. And in order to do this, let's see here. I've actually, whoa. Okay. Huh. All right. I'll be right back. I gotta uh, relog because it's in. It's doing that thing. Be right back. Okay. We back. <laughs> that was strange. I had a uh, out of memory error, which is not typically something that I would get. Oh, I gotta get my stuff. Okay. So first, we're gonna work on. I think this is a really cool. Uh, let's just grab a lot of this stuff that I know I'll probably need. Some of that. And anything. We'll grab this guy. And yeah, that probably works for right now. Okay, so the first thing I want to do is work on the, on the randomization and the treat part of things. So this is where we'll put the treats when we're done. So we can put that back like there uh, and just so I know where we're messing with I want to put that like that all right so we'll go under here and we 
get rid of that business. Okay, so we know that this is where the chest is, which means we can take, grab ourselves some of this. The trap chest will actually power the block and any redstone that we put underneath it, I believe. No, is that right? Mm, I'm thinking. Will it? Let's try that out. Uh, and then, here, we'll put a dispenser right there. Yeah, 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 we're good. Okay, so let's take this guy out. Uh -huh. Perfect. And then we can go like this, but it'll only make it one uh, one pulse length, or one, <laughs> all right, it's time to explain redstone. <laughs> it will only make enough power to power one length of redstone. So what this will do is that'll power that, and hopefully that will power this as well. Let's do another little test. This is my this is my sound sound check test. So we'll go back over here. I just want to make sure. So we open it. Click. You hear that click? Okay. So we're good there. Just want to make sure. And so we got that guy. We can get rid of you for right now. Okay, so then this repeater will power that. And we might as well make it go down a little ways. And power one there. And then we need a dropper. Now this part, it's the same, uh, same setup that Etho is using for the death games for randomization. And it's a really slick very simple idea. Uh, let's put this right here for right now. Uh, so we're just going to dig. We'll see. Mm -hmm. Three should work. We'll put a redstone comparator right there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. A couple of those. But then we're going to do something. Of course, I have to remove that. Of course. <laughs> Put something down, of course you have to get rid of it. Uh, and then I'm going to put two repeaters, and I'll show you why I'm doing this in just a second here. With a that and a that and a that and a that. Okay. Now what we do is, in this dropper right here, we're going to put one item that can stack up to 64. So we'll put a dirt. And one item that can't stack at all and it looks like for right now i'm just going to put my sword in there right and so what this does is whenever this gets a signal so every time we open up that trap chest uh the signal will come down this will uh get triggered it will shoot uh something up in the uh into the hopper it's either going to be the dirt or the sword if it's the dirt dirt is only enough to trigger the one little uh, redstone in front of this comparator. And so that will be like a, a one signal. So we can say like that, maybe that is uh, considered the treat, let's say, right? Um, and the if the sword goes through, that doesn't stack, so it's a stronger signal. So it'll go both ways, and we'll want that to be the trick. And... In order to make it where you, you don't want to get, you want to, it's called trick or treat, not trick and treat, right? So if that sword comes up and this triggers there, you want to make sure that the trick fires, but not the treat. And that's why we have this little guy right here. Um, and it's sort of like an AND gate in a way, and I'll explain how it works. If the dirt comes up, you want the treat to go through. So this will go, this, this will power, but this one won't. Uh, that means it'll go through this, it'll turn off this torch, which will then turn on that torch. Uh, and then from that point, what we want to do is we will run through a little bit. So it'll go down there. And, oh, hello now. 
I'm just gonna run, dig a little bit more out. I like putting um, my redstone on on uh, cobble, if at all possible, to prevent people from digging it out. Uh, and then we're just gonna go down, we're gonna do a torch here and a torch there. So you can see right now it's off. If we get something in, here let's, uh, do I have something to make a, oh wow, I have something to make a button, how about me? So this will be our tester, right? So if it'll go, if it's just the dirt that goes through here, let's let's show this, take this iron sword out. If the dirt goes through, right? That one signal's going through. Uh, oh, why you know, uh, oh, it may be because of this. You're not supposed to do that. Stop it. That's probably why. Let's, ooh, let's double check. I wanna make sure that that's not broken. Okay. Hmm, okay, we have an issue. Now why in the world? Something is causing this to uh huh. Wait, wait for it. Oh, it is that guy right there. Why are you there? Uh, wait. You don't. I've done something wrong. Hmm. Let me go look at my stuff. Be right back. Okay. It was something simple. <laughs> Here, let me show you what I did really quick. Um, it's just here's the chest. Instead of having the, I, I messed it up. Instead of having the redstone right under it, I'm sending it over to the side. So it just brings this whole thing over one. And it, everything else stayed the same. It's just like if you come up here now, you can see like there's the two torches. Those don't mess with each other, but there's no like funky redstone right here. So we don't have to worry about none of that. So now let me show you. Let me show you something here, right? Um... Now, if I just have the dirt, it'll go one signal there, it'll go through, turn this off, turn that on, which will go through that torch tower and turn this torch on. And if it is the sword or something that doesn't stack and I push this button, you'll notice that doesn't turn on, right? And that is because uh, it's going to have more than one signal going out, right? A stronger signal. So both of these will get powered. And because there's a delay on this one, while this one is turning off, this one is also turning on, right? And so, like, this is kind of like a, it's not a zero tick pulse, but it's just like making sure, like, you don't, it's not, uh, it's not firing at all. This is the same type of setup we used to use for little one tick pulses. I think you would make it like that and it would give you exactly one tick, but this is what we want. Now, a, we wanna run something off of this though in order to make it go to the trick part of things. And that's where we go over here. And this is, we're gonna use the old, the old hopper clock, the old standby. Uh, and then I think, from here, I'll probably do it over this way. I may have to do a little bit of digging. Nothing nothing too terrible. Uh, maybe around here too. Just give us a little room here. A little room to breathe. Uh, and we'll put two there. I've got my two hoppers, so that works out great. Uh, we'll put one there. Stick one in like that. Tear a guy out. One like that. Now the reason we're doing this is we want to have the the trick last for a while, right? And so uh, I'm just gonna while I'm t while I'm explaining, I'm gonna talk. Uh, so we want to have like a pulse. We want this pulse because right now this will be a very quick pulse. So just go boom, right? Um, but what we want it to have happen is we want this thing to last for a longer amount of time, and that is why we will do. This little hopper guy, because it's great for extending 
uh, extending a pulse out. Uh, we'll take a repeater right there. And all this is, I won't go into full explanations, uh, but basically what this is, is it's an RS Norlatch tied to, uh, tied to a couple hoppers. And we've used something, I, I think we may have used this exact thing uh, in the, um, uh, in the Witch Cauldron Brewing system, I believe. Uh, and so we'll put another comparator there, and then we'll put a repeater to extend the signal, and then we'll run that off somewhere. I uh, just want to make sure, yep, and then we can put a certain amount of items. It, at this point, it doesn't matter uh, what type of item, so I'm just going to put in this, well, no, let's put in some stuff that I will never think of again. Okay, so 16. So you see it's going through. The signal is on, right? And then it's stuck there. Okay. And hold on, my wife, my wife, and I don't want to stop. Uh, she's asking if I want recording. Yes, please, sandwich, send. <laughs> okay. So, here we want to run it up, and we'll have to do some creative work here. Let's go back up, and we want to use this guy, seems like a pretty good spot, to run up a bit of a... Is that going to work? Maybe. We'll see how it goes. Uh, go hop. And then, huh? And then if we climb up the the back here, we have some. Oop! Let's go up this way. Bonk, 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 bonk. Uh, we'll tear this out a little bit just to see what we're working with. Where is that torch? Okay, so we got that guy. If we put a torch there. So right now that is on, that's perfect. That's exactly what we would want. Uh, if we go like this and just run, yeah, perfect. Run some redstone, we'll run it down like that. Let's tear this out to see, perfect. Uh, and if we were betting men, which we are, if we take these two purples and we move them like right there and we put, aha, uh -huh. okay, so that brings that down, perfect. Uh, let's go down here. Now, we'll make sure that we've got one of each item in here, so we don't, so we'll do that. Everything at this point should be good to go. Let's give it a test. So imagine if you're a customer, imagine the witch is in here, which that will be a difficult and fun thing to do. Um, imagine if I go, yep, I'm interested. Here's a Spider-Man costume. I'll have a little sign that says all of these are, you know, a gold block or something like that. And they go, yep, I'm interested. They throw it in. Nothing happened. Why no? Why you know? Oh, so that worked. Okay. Okay, that one clicked. So clicking works. Okay, that's another treat. That does not work. Okay, so let's go see why. Maybe we have done something wrong here. Oh, because <laughs> we're idiots, that's why. <laughs> okay, all right, let's do, let's figure this out. We need to put a torch. Oh, come on now. Need to put a torch right there, right there. 
I'm a complete idiot. And we'll turn this down. And don't, don't, don't. Oh, this goes to there. Let's get rid of that. Okay, that should work. <laughs> when in doubt, connect your redstone. Stupid. Okay, so now it's down. I open it. I got a treat. I open it. Got a treat. Great. Open it. Ooh, my lucky day. One more time. Oh, all right. And seriously, seriously, really, really, everybody gets treats. What is this, an Oprah shop? There it goes. And I'm like, oh my God, I can't believe it. Pew, 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 pew. And see how it lasts for a little while. Shoot, shoot, shoot. But then after a while, it'll go back down. Perfect. That's exactly what I'm looking for. Okay. I think we might be good to go. The only thing I really lack, like I said, is I got to get the witch in there. That should be fun. And then I'll, I'll purtify this up a little bit. Uh, I will... Oh, someone's making trees. Uh, I will get the two horses from uh, from Blame's place. I need a white horse and a dark horse, and then put some uh, put some some pricing to this thing. Okie doke. I think that's it for today. Happy October. Happy Halloween. Hopefully this will be a good business. Hopefully I make a ton of money, and then I don't have to worry about paying B dubs. <laughs> if you like this episode, leave a like. I appreciate it greatly. Until next time, take care. Brush your hair. I'll see you when I see you. Peace.